Welcome to Algebra, Polynomials, the Basics. What is a polynomial anyway? Well, the term itself gives a clue. The prefix poly originates in the Greek language meaning many. We also see it in geometry with the term polygon, which means a many-sided figure. The term nomial comes from Latin and means name, and so you could literally translate the word polynomial to mean many names. However, in mathematics, it actually means many terms, and we've discussed the idea of terms in prior lessons. Let's review what a term is, and some other names we'll use in this lesson. What is a term? Well, a term is a single expression, like 45, or the variable x, or the combination of 45 and x multiplied together. All of these are single terms used in mathematical expressions, equations, and inequalities, as you have seen many times in previous lessons. Another name you will start to use for a single term is monomial, which means one term. Monomial, binomial, and trinomial are names similar to polynomial, but have more specific meanings. The prefix mono means one, and so a monomial indicates a single term, as we mentioned on the previous slide. The prefix by means two, and we recognize this with several English words, such as bicycle, which means two wheels, or bipartisan, which means two political parties in agreement, and many others. A binomial is a two-term expression, separated by the plus or the minus operator. The prefix tri means three, also used in many English words like tricycle or triwizard tournament, and in this case trinomial, which means three terms, also separated by the plus or the minus operator. A polynomial has a degree associated with it, an integer value indicating how complex it is based on the terms it contains. This trinomial, 3x squared plus 45x minus 12, contains three terms with different degrees of complexity. The first term, 3x squared, is the most complex since it contains a variable with an exponent value of 2, and so its degree is 2, matching the exponent value. The second term, 45x, has a degree of 1, matching the implied exponent value of 1 for the variable x. The third term, the constant value 12, has a degree of 0, since it does not contain a variable. Of the three terms, the degree of the most complex term is 2, and so the degree of the entire polynomial is 2. This three-term polynomial with highest degree of 2 is technically called a degree 2 trinomial. What about this one? How would you name this polynomial? 3x squared plus 45x. If you thought this is a degree 2 binomial, you are correct. This one would also be a degree 2 binomial. 3x squared minus 12. What about this one? 12. This is simply a degree 0 monomial. One term, no variable, a constant value. Let's try one more. x minus 5. This is a degree 1 binomial. Two terms, the most complex of which is a variable whose implied exponent is 1. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.